Okay, back to the Cambridge unit. What we got here is we got the sleepers with the two by six on them. We're extending them about one inch past on both sides. And then you got your main curb right here. Now, as far as centering your main curb here, what we have found has worked easy. We normally have a guy below and we check the steel and we measure on the inside of the curb to get the centered on the steel or you can use your fingers and eyeball it and a lot of times you got the seam on the roof here that you can go off of but you got to square this curb and then you measure to do the corners off the sleeper to square each sleeper up so this this here is ready to go to set the cambridge unit what we're going to do here in the next day or so we don't got our, our our particular lift for about another week or two but we are going to take the wood off we're going to use a straight edge which we're probably going to use strut we're going to run it from the main curb to the sleeper to the first sleeper and to the second sleeper and what we're going to do is we're going to measure down our drop and then on the ground we are going to adjust our legs prior to the helicopter lift we're going to get them real close so the day of the helicopter lift, because it moves so fast, we're going to set it right down. We'll have it set. Then the guys can come by. And then what we can do is we can tweak each one and adjust the minor adjustments, and we should be good to go.